Hey guys, welcome back to a quick Ninjago video here on the channel. My name is Tanner Fishies. In today's video, we're going to be discussing something very, very quickly regarding the newly leaked uh, Ninjago clips, courtesy of what I understand is a Canadian Teletoon network. Uh, Teletoon, eh? Um, familiar, familiar name in the Ninjago community, that's for sure, uh, back during the season 11 days. So in case you guys have not been made aware, recently there have been several clips either released unofficially or leaked from this random Teletoon network in Canada. They're all in French, all the clips are in French, but we have several clips regarding Ninjago Crystallized. Apparently there's going to be one clip for each of the first 12 episodes of the season. Now in terms of these clips, again we are going to be getting into spoilers in today's video, so if you have not yet seen these clips I'd recommend clicking off the video, uh, avoiding spoilers the best that you can. For the most part, thankfully these clips don't really spoil much, but there are indeed a couple of things that I would have rather have not known about going into Crystallized, so keep that in mind. But the big rumor right now is that since we have a clip for each of the uh, first 12 episodes, it seems like this season is going to be very, very long, especially considering how usually with these Ninjago uh, Wild Brain era seasons, we traditionally expect a 16 episode season, as was the case with Prime Empire, Master of the Mountain, and now Seabound. According to the clips, what we're going to be seeing for these first 12 episodes is basically the ninja in prison and all of that kind of stuff. We have not really seen anything regarding the Crystal King, any of the crystals for that matter, the Venge Stone, none of the returning villains unless you count Asphira uh, and those types of people. So it seems like to me that this season is going to be very, very long. It honestly seems like the first half of the season is going to be the ninja dealing with the police and also trying to get Nia back. Then once Nia returns, the ninja are going to be arrested. So there's that. And then finally, maybe, potentially, when the ninja eventually do get broken out of prison, maybe that will be the the start of the crystallized stuff. All the crystals, all the Venge Stone, all the returning bad guys, the Crystal King, the Overlord, all of that good stuff. So in terms of how many episodes this season could have, well, we've seen super long seasons before in Wild Brain, specifically season 11, which had 30 episodes, if you guys remember, and that season was very much a part one, part two situation, similar to what crystallized may be. I've heard some people throw around the 40 episode mark. I'm pretty sure that's just a rumor right now. I have not seen anything official uh, regarding the 40 episode mark. I'm thinking maybe 30. I think 30 is a much more reasonable prediction, I guess you could say, for these, uh, for how many episodes the new Ninjago crystallized season will have. But yeah, guys, it seems like we're going to be seeing a whole bunch of new episodes based off of new evidence that we got today. A very long season sounds good to me. A very long Ninjago crystallized season sounds awesome. And I'm looking forward to seeing what the season is actually all about. Fingers crossed we don't get any more leaks in between now and the official release of this season. Fingers crossed, man. I want to go into this as blind as humanly possible, so hopefully that happens. Until then, guys, thank you all so much for watching today's video. Uploaded a couple of other videos earlier today. If you haven't checked those out just yet, feel free to do so, and that'll pretty much wrap it up for my thoughts here today. Be sure to leave a like and subscribe, do all that fun stuff, and I'll catch you guys again later. Peace.